I'm standing here with my uh, daughter's step stool that I made for her a couple of years ago. You might recognize it. I had it on my Facebook. And it's kind of an object lesson, I think, uh, to what I want to kick off the year with here as we start a new year. It has to do with what we depend on. Um, this is a stool that I built so my daughter can stand on it and trust it and depend upon it while she's watching me build other projects. Uh, lots of folks say that Jesus is just a crutch or God is just a crutch. And they make fun of Christians for believing in a crutch. You know, it's interesting that it's really politically incorrect to make fun of lame people who use crutches uh, because they need them. So the real question here is not whether we are leaning on something like Jesus as a crutch, but whether we're lame or not, whether we need that, whether we're injured in a way that causes us to require something to hold us up. When I was a kid, we used to, uh, we used to say, oh, that's as funny as a rubber crutch because we knew that rubber crutches weren't funny. That when people leaned on a rubber crutch, you know, they fell over and, and uh, that was the point that we're making. Well, it turns out that if we are injured, if we are lame, if there's something that is wrong with human beings, then we need something to lean on. And the real question is whether or not your crutch can hold you, because everybody leans on something. And so the question that I have to ask is, what, what are you leaning on now? What, what is the person you're talking to about Christianity leaning on now? If what you're leaning on is the kind of thing that could be here today and gone tomorrow, you're leaning on a rubber crutch. And that's not funny. Because your dependence is on something you can't count on. Do Christians lean on Jesus? Yes. Is Jesus a crutch? Yes. Crippled people need crutches. And I'm hoping that as you think about your walk with Christ this year, that you're thinking about leaning on him as someone who can hold you through thick and through thin.